Good morning, Erin. So I actually had no idea that this place existed. We have merchandise in here. We have a ton of bikes. This is off the 99. We are at the Harley Davidson store. Say hello to Emily. She's in charge of merchandise here. And we're going to talk about free gifts they have going on and also some of the merchandise clearly to help you look ready for spring, ready to go out and ride like a pro. Because I always see these people decked out head to toe and they look they look fabulous, and of course, they look like they're natural riders. So tell me what you have here and uh, what's going to be going on at the Harley store. Well, we have a lot of um, general merchandise that's good for safety and riding, and it's functional and comfortable. Um, we have rain jackets. We have leather jackets. We have chaps. We have vests. Anything you can think of, Harley has it, um, and it is very comfortable. Do you want to give us an example? I'm seeing all this pink, which I'm surprised. I haven't actually seen anyone ride around in pink before. Well, this is part of um, the breast cancer collection, the pink label collection. Um, she's layered, so she has um, a functional leather jacket on, and she has her, her pink top underneath. And then this is um, rain gear. And uh, we have pink helmets that match it. And then he has the high visibility rain gear. Um, it has the 360 um, scotch lip material for high visibility. So it's very functional, safe. And um, back here we have um, the new leather jacket. The new leather jacket. Okay, so I was actually, I was going to look back here because this is what I normally typically see people riding around in. Mm -hmm. This is awesome. Yeah, this is a new uh, women's leather jacket. Um, it has like the nice red stitching. It's reflective. It has a liner that comes out of it. And this is the lightweight jacket for men. Um, we have vests. We have boots. Now, I was going to say, apparently I'm getting on one of these things later, and I definitely wore the wrong, wrong shoes today. So I'm curious to know if we have a shoe in my size and how important it is to make sure you're riding around in something um, like a boot. Yes, it's very important. You want that ankle support in the boots. This one is new. We have this in your size. Okay, nice. <laughs> I'm going to look amazing. Hey, where did Ben go? He's hiding from me over there. Okay, so, you know, Emily was mentioning um, pink for breast cancer, but you were also mentioning before you went on camera mm -hmm. the other charities that you guys are involved with. Well, Harley-Davidson, we this store in particular, our community involvement is absolutely incredible. We uh, have an annual MDA ride that has gone on for more than 25 years. We have the uh, Armed Forces Support Foundation and the Veterans Support that comes out of this store is unmatched and the community involvement anytime something is going on in the community be it a bike blessing or something like that people will come and, and use this facility to make their event happen and it's it's pretty tremendous it's so much more than just a, a place to come buy a motorcycle or a pink jacket I like that. Definitely more than just a jacket and uh, buying stuff. So I appreciate you being on camera right now. We're going to uh, give you a little tour. Take a look at what's around here just so you can see. I mean, I'm not sure how big this place is square footage wise, but there's a lot of stuff in here. Gear. We have neck pillows, travel neck pillows too. We just got a lot of stuff. We're going to take you around a little more and we're going to give you an inside scoop on new riders, what you should be riding versus um, what the professionals ride and um, maybe some tips and tricks to head out of town this weekend if you're thinking about buying one of these bad boys, what you should expect and of course what else they've got in store for you for springtime. Stick with us. We're going to have more here at the Harley Davidson store coming up and just a little bit on Fox 58. Don't move. Aaron and Aaron, back to you. Good morning, Aaron. So they are trying to uh, make me look legit right now. So as you can see, I switched out my heels. I was wearing white heels earlier for these amazing boots. Let me tell you, they are some of the most comfortable boots I have put on. I have been saying it ever since I put them on, how comfortable they are. I put on this amazing jacket. I mean, I'm looking so legit right now. I know everyone at home is like, I want to bike because I want to look like her. I don't think they're thinking that. But look, they even wanted me to wear the, the face mask thing so I don't get bugs in my mouth, which is great because we're indoors and that's not going to happen. But Al is here. <laughs> He's going to show you from beginning to end what kind of bike you should get depending on what level you're at. Al, say good morning to everyone at home. Everybody. How excited are you to be here this morning? I'm excited every day. Okay, perfect. I love this energy. So thank you so much for my mask. I was asking for it earlier, and um, I love the skull. I think it's great. I think it really helped me channel in my inner bad boy. 
I would say. A tat by the end of the day. I already asked for one so far. Okay, let's take a look at all the space that we have. We have a ton of bikes here, and I don't even know where to start. So you're going to guide me. I'm a beginner. I'm a new rider. So what should I be going towards today? New rider, you want to start as small, as light as possible. Just like anything, you grow into them. So you start off in the 750, 500 market, and then move up to an 883, 1200 engine CCs. And explain that to me one more time. <laughs> <laughs> eight, uh, 750 gives you 750 cc's. Um, light enough, small enough to where you can control the weight. Okay. And then after that you move around. So, so is this something that's lighter? Yes. Okay, so let's see how light it is because you were telling me this earlier that this is going to be something light. And hey, we should talk about prices because I just looked at the price tag here. This is 8500 bucks. That's pretty good. I thought these were going to be like $30,000 bikes. So I, I'm, I'm very much enjoying this. Okay, so I'm already doing something wrong because this thing isn't moving. What am I doing? <laughs> well, go ahead and what put am I doing now? Oh, I have to put my leg over this thing. Yes. Okay, leg is over. Okay. Did I do that right? Is there a technique? Yeah. Go okay. That. Now let's have you lift that baby. Let's have, I, oh, I'm lifting it entirely. Oh, okay. <laughs> I feel like I fit the part. Now what? Am I supposed to turn this thing on and run you over? No. No. <laughs> Absolutely no. not. <laughs> um, I mean, this gives you the idea of the weight of these. They're not that heavy to start you off. And, um, okay, yeah. And then you can move from there. I mean, it, as long as you can control the, the weight of the bike, uh -huh. then you got a little more control on the street. You got to watch the people around you, not just watch what you're doing. I like this. Okay, I like this. I'm feeling more comfortable, especially because you're holding it for me. So we have a little um, ride area in the back that we're going to get to in just a second. Stick with us. We're going to tour Harley Davidson all morning long here on Fox 58. When I win this news comes right back. Good morning, Aaron. So we are here, Harley Davidson store. This is off the 99, and I have my guys and girl behind me. Uh, ben is making some sound effects. Now, I feel like these motorcycles actually sound a lot better than what you're doing, but if you want to give our viewers a taste of what you think these should sound like, go for it. <laughs> that is awful. Okay, so before he went on camera, I wanted him to ride this one, and he said he's too much of a man for it, so he decided to get on this one instead. But we have Al. Say hello to Al. He's on the corner in the red one. We have Ben. Say hello to him. He's on this beautiful, manly black bike. And we have Emily here with one of the starter bikes. And before I get into all this, they're already giving this away. So I was chilling on this earlier. It's nice. It's a little cooler underneath and a chair. 300 bucks. If you spend here, you get this for free. I like this. I like incentive people. So we're talking about springtime. Let me go over here to Al because we have so many bikes. I don't even know where to start. So I'm going to leave you cozy on here, Ben. But Al, so tell me, what are we going to start with here? These are just the beginner bikes these again. Are beginner bi all three of these all are beginner of these. Okay. You try to start on the 750 and move your way up. This is the 1200 I'm sitting on. And it's a 1200cc, so it gives you a little more power and performance. Um, but really, it's, it's still a starter bike, gets you going. Great commuter around town. Uh, home bike. I mean, if you're just going to go to college, to work, and home, that's, this is perfect. Okay, so before I went on camera, Ben, you were telling me that there's a lot of different types of people who ride bikes. Do you want to go through the range that you were telling me earlier? Oh, the range of, of people that come in and buy Harley-Davidson motorcycles. We, we have physicians, we have attorneys, we have... Um, all walks of life, the oil field, obviously construction workers, um, farm workers, everything. It's, it's virtually all walks of life that come in and, and purchase these motorcycles and ride with us on all the different events. Now you're going to have a reporter who's going to start riding with you on all of the events. Okay, so let's, let's take a look at some of the other stuff that we have here because there's a lot, like I said, a lot of ground to cover. I don't even know where I'm going, so where am I going? I'm going to follow you. Next one's the Road King. Okay, the Road King. Still full-size, mid-size bike. No fairing, no windshield. Um, just the windshield on it, but it's still a good commuter, uh, in home, run around town, and then after that would be the road glide. So that's the uh, road glide right here. Road glide. So I love little, how yeah. you, you have the little compartments back there too, right? Yes. So you leave your home at six in the morning. You need a jacket. And you need a sweater. When you get to the coast, you can take it off. You got a place to put it. I love that. I think we already ran out of time, but take a look at this red one. I love this color and everything about it, too. Okay, so I'm obsessed with Harley Davidson. I just want everyone at home to know. Do you want to get on the back with me, Al? Get, get back there. No, you get back there first. Stick with us. Yeah, or maybe, I don't know the order, okay? I'm learning. I'm a new writer, everybody. 
Stick with us. We're going to have more here at the Harley Davidson store. Oh. You're not behind me. You're supposed to be behind me. We're going to go on a little ride. Aaron, Aaron, I'm tossing it back to you. You look great. We look great back there. <laughs> hey. on a roller coaster. Guys, Looking tossing good, it back Kalina. to you. Thanks. <laughs> good morning, Aaron. Yeah, we're here at Harley Davidson, and I am about to get on this bad boy now. Luckily, this is the best part about it. It's bolted to the ground, so I'm not really going anywhere. But Don's going to teach me how to get on this thing and ride it the right way. We have safety classes, right, so people can get familiar with it. Now, I'm a new rider, so what are the things that I need to know in order to get ready for my uh, first time on this thing? Well, first off, you want to understand what the bike is. You want to understand <laughs> the bike. Um, since this one is bolted to the ground, we don't have to worry about none of the picking up or anything, but you want to get on. You want to get place your feet firmly on the foot pegs. Am I doing that now? You want to go ahead and climb For some reason, that? I'm still frightened. I don't know why. Okay, so we'll we'll get on this thing. I did I did learn um, sort of earlier. Okay, I'm nice and comfortable. And this is a starter bike, right? Yes, this is where entry level is called the street. This is a 750 street. So at this point, you would be ready to start the bike. Okay, ready to start the bike. And I have to actually start the bike. Actually, yeah. Ben, do you mind kind of holding this so I can do three things at once? Thank you, sir. No problem. Hold it here so I can so I can talk. Gotcha. So Ben's gonna take my job. Okay. No. Okay. So <laughs> ignition. Ignition. Just turn I. This is power only. And now you're gonna hit Nothing this happened. button right here. A little longer. I hear it. I hear it. Relax. Okay. Now what do I do? Now this is your throttle. This We've got a couple times to get the feel of it. Not so much. About half of that. Okay. Just gotta do a little bit. I feel, are, are my feet supposed to be on this thing? Put your feet up here. Yeah. Okay, Hold just making clutch. sure. I wasn't sure. Hold the now pull the clutch. Pretty clutch, nice and slow. I'm really glad this is bolted to the ground, everybody. This pull is away. this is awesome. So are that we. Side. That's what Ben said. Uh -huh. All you need is the grip, not the lever. This side, the lever only. What does the lever do? So if you pull this thing, it's gonna do the clutch. So scary. Now you're gonna pull the right down here is your gear shifter. It's gear shifter. One down. Now it's in gear. Now you're gonna let you ready? Get the get the look of the, the owner's face is back there and he's just staring at me like shaking his head. I'm so glad this is bolted to the ground too. Yes, we all are very happy this morning. Are moment. you ready to take off? Sure, I'm ready to take off. Let the clutch off with a wheelie Easy. down. Okay, we're doing a wheelie. No, 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 we're not doing a wheelie. Okay, so we'll let the clutch out real nice hey, and slow. Guess what? We ran out of time. Thank goodness. Stick with us here on Eyewitness News. I'm gonna ride off into the sunset here. At the Harley-Davidson store, you can come visit them as well. I would assume this is going to be right back.